Hi everybody, welcome back to Kia TT, and this tutorial is how to create your own file extension, which comes in handy and is pretty cool. So first, you open the registry, and it'll give you a UAC prompt, and just accept the UAC prompt, say yes to this UAC prompt, so just press Windows and R, reg edit. And you type in that. And you type in Reddit and Registry Editor. And now, H key class is root. You can create a new key in here. You can create a new key in here. New key. So, this has all the file extensions in here. This folder. I mean this key, so just, so the key will be, uh, named, the key will be named, dot key at, so, it has to be dot before, so you put any word here, so you can just, uh, also, I'm gonna create another one, so it's gonna be, so it's gonna be, oh, this is in the dot key at folder, so I have to delete this key. So I have to delete this key right here. So I deselected that key, so go all the way up here and select H key classes root and new key again. And you just do dot whatever you want, like some file. Dot some file. So you just gotta remember those extensions. And now restart the computer. Oh. The control out delete menu. That's my host's control out delete menu, but. I'm going uh in Windows in my virtual machines control delete menu. So I'm uh going to uh restart restart the computer. I mean restart the VM in this case. And then back in the virtual machine. So now we can create our own, our own, uh, file extension. So let me demonstrate by making a file. Let me demonstrate by making a file. So we can go to all apps. We can just, uh, search up notepad because it's quicker. Notepad. So just do notepad. So notepad, you click right here, and there it is. So I'm gonna just type in A B C one two three in my file. And then I'm gonna save it as my file right here. So you just save it all files, all files. And then Dot. So you can just do whatever your file name is. Dot your custom created file extension. So for this case, I'm gonna do one dot key it. And then now we can go in Windows Explorer or File Explorer, whatever you call it. And now. So this is our custom file extension right here. So when it prompts you which app to open with, just open it with Notepad. And now I'm going to do for the second one. The quicker way is Windows R and Notepad. So we're 
run a notepad, so A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, that's the same thing. So, so you save it as, so, 2 dot, some file. So, now we saved it as our own, oh, my mom's just playing a little bit of music in the background, but I hope I don't get a copyright strike, but. Yeah. So you just use Notepad. So just use Notepad to open all your custom file extension. So you make as many as you want, as long as you know what you're doing. So if you're a novice computer user, learn more about the registry because don't mess with the registry, novice computer users. Never ever mess with the registry until you learned about it, all novice computer users. So now I'm going to end the video here. And yeah, that's how you do it. That's a quick tutorial, and that's pretty much it. Subscribe if you want more stuff like this. And hit the like button.